So we are headed up to South Dakota. My buddy Jason Curley has been telling me about this trip. They've been going for about six or eight years and he's been bragging about how good the hunting is. And finally, me and Brooke had talked, talked with Stubbs and some more. It was like, put us down. We just made it work out where we could all go at the same time. So how this pheasant hunting came about was way back 10 or 15 years ago we were on the committee for the rocky mountain elk foundation for years we held a banquet in hattiesburg the last couple of years we were involved with it uh this guy mr edward haynes came down and he donated a hunt that we could raffle off or auction off i think it was the last year he came down and did it mr jim jason's father-in-law and jason they went in and bought it on the live auction this is like trick number four for me so you're a pro at this. Well, I don't know about a pro. I, I will shoot, though. All right, we just got our bellies full. We're fixing to get on the bus and head over there and go shoot a few pheasants. Jace, are we going to shoot some? Yes. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but... you going to film, right? Yes, I am. Heck yeah. We load up on this old school bus, and our driver's Jason Curley. I was a little nervous about this. Uh, First being on a bus, and then being on a bus with Curly driving. So as Jason's driving us in on this bus, we, we gotta stop by Daniel's house and uh, pick him up, pick the dogs up. And right before you get to his house, there's pheasants everywhere. Morning, how you been, sir? Good, Good to see you. That was you. That was you, I think. Oh, was that me? Did you hit that bird? Well, I'll eat on. This is it. This is where it's going down. A bunch of birds we done seen jumped up. Some's over in the corn. It's going, it's, we ought to get our limit right here. This first field was the honey hole. Off to an awesome start here in South Dakota, shooting pheasants with the crew. Last leg of the tour. And we're getting this thing kicking. Another one in there somewhere? Yeah, he's right here. I can see my feet. There, we got him. 14 right there, right off the bat. Not playing around here in South Dakota. <laughs> Mississippi boys have come to do work. We're showing out right now. This is an epic hunt. Candy bar? Candy <laughs> bar and load up and kill more birds.
quick draw. It's day three on the hunt. We've had an awesome time so far, but today's gonna be a little bit different. A cedar plantation instead of crop fields. It's gonna be a little bit more challenging. The wind's blowing pretty good. And when these birds get up, they go. Oh, what a fine looking crop. Working up through the cedars and uh, Daniel's pushing the dogs through trying to flush some birds up and it's amazing how much control he has over the dogs. They tell them to go left or tell them to go right and they respond right away. Starting out good, first little run here. Picked up a couple. <clears throat> I shot at one. They're, all of them been going to the right when they get up. That wind is just pushing. Thank you. I smoked that. Oh, you smoked there. I one shot, one kill, son. Sure enough, stubs will shoot the final bird to fill the limit. I got him! I got him! He did! Whoa! Hold up, boys! Hold up! Well, that pretty much wraps up the divorce tour. I missed the first couple legs, caught in with the crew on the last one, and uh, Luckily, we're all still married. I know Stubbs and Wimbern was gone for about two months, it seemed, and uh, Brooke was gone for at least two or three weeks. If our wives wanted to leave us, this was the time they would have done it, but we're lucky. We're real lucky men. They stuck with us. Big shout out to our good old buddy, Jason Curley, for inviting us. We surely appreciate the invite, bud, and uh, looking forward to doing it again one day. Get out, bird. Get out, bird! Get out, bird! <laughs> <laughs> I 
They look like, I can't even say that word, paradactyl, what do you call them, Brooke? <laughs> Some kind of dactyl, I can tell you that. You can't see this book, can you? I'm making Oh, I'm, you can't see it in the camera. Huh? Okay. <laughs> you thought I made I couldn't see the screen. <laughs>